and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders. Alright, let's head to bed. Actually, before I head to bed, let me see something real quick. What do I actually need to make the uh, watering hole? Who was the one who gave me the quest again? Was it Casey? Uh, it was Casey. Alright, so I need a comfy stool, a wash tub, and a chest. Oh, and two pots. Alright, let's build those then. I think I have the materials for all of those, actually. So let me see, I need two pots. Where are the pots? I think I skipped them. There they are. Alright, two pots. Uh, I need a comfy stool. What do I need? Oh, I need wood. Actually, I can get wood really easily. Like this. Also, yeah, my inventory is full right now. There we go. Ooh, a sewing station. Uh, wooden wall block. Actually, I think I can make some, uh... Oh, floors. That's not what I meant to say. I think I can make... Oh, wow. I am making a bunch of stuff. I don't even remember what I was going to say anymore. That was just a ton of stuff. Oh, I can make a... Where is it? One steps now. No, I can't make the cating. That's what I wanted to say. Not yet. Alright, that's fine. Let's see, I need a comfy stool. And then I think I need a wash basin. Or wash tub. Alright, that's er I think that's everything I need. Oh, and a chest. Did I make a chest yet? I don't think I made a chest. Perfect. Oh, I think I also need a door. Awesome. Alright, first things first. Let's uh, put away some of this stuff. Gonna put that there for now. I need food. Oh, is that- Oh, that's on a wall. I'll fix that. Oh, crap. Monsters are around. Here, you guys deal with those. I'm going to bed. I'll find some food in the morning. Luckily, when you starve in this game, it's a pretty slow process. And sleep doesn't affect it at all. Alright, so let me see here. What are you guys doing? Oh, I saw what you were doing. You were uh, fighting those guys at night. And you guys just kind of froze in that position. Alright, perfect. So let me see here. Oh, I should probably find a place to put that bench to. Oh, and food. Yeah, like I said, I should probably find some food. Oh, I need to grab the door. I thought I picked that up. Alright, so pot here. Pot here. Uh, let's see, sconces. Let's put a sconce right here. That counts as a light source. Actually, speaking of light sources, yeah, let's uh, decorate this area a bit better. Do I have any food in here? I do. Eating. There we go. Not dying anymore. Also, that guy does not look very... Are you okay? I'm sure he's fine. Actually, maybe I should make a second bed for that guy that's still sleeping on the floor. Oh, crap, crap. Nope, nope. I can fix this. Sorry about that, L. Lee. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. So now we have a bit more space to move around in. So let me see. Oh, I didn't pick up the uh, door yet. Yeah, I really should make up another bed. What can I put away? What the heck is that? Oh! Middle window! Good job, guys! That's actually kind of surprising. Actually, yeah, while I'm here, can I also make myself an axe? No, I can't. I thought I, could make my I, thought I unlocked how to make an axe. Oh, I think it's under the uh, sewing workstation. You know what? I have the materials. How big is this? Can I fit it in here? Oh, I can't fit it in here. I eventually want to make my own room for this, but what can I make through here? Oh, yep, there it is. Stone axe. I need wood. Also, it's considered a hammer, so I can break stuff with it. Although, honestly, it's kind of better as a weapon until I can get the iron broadsword. 
Yeah, it's honestly a better weapon. But I'll worry about that later. Did I still not- I still didn't pick up the door. Here, I'm gonna put the stuff down then. Oh, also. Clearing up. Oh, I also need to find a place for that water block at some point. Alright, let's go fill up this room. Oh, there's one more thing I want to do. Now that we have seedlings, we can plant them inside the town and get a good source of wood. Oh, right, I can't plant them in bedrock. Okay, new plan. Also, yeah, they won't grow if you plant them outside of town. They have to be inside of town. Huh. That's a new monster we haven't seen before. Don't worry. We're fine. Actually, wait, is he not going to come into town because we're underwater? Huh. This is, uh, working surprisingly well. Oh, never mind, he's in the... <laughs> yeah, he's coming after me. But yeah, I'm just gonna plant the trees in these little... I'm gonna plant the trees right here. There we go. Yeah, don't mind us. Kind of surprised that my townspeople haven't started, you know, trying to get rid of him. Then again, he can't really do much. I wonder if I can trap him in town and just make him like the town pet or something. Anyway, so all we need is a comfy stool, and then a chest. And that should be the watering hole. Ten blocks of water, a chest, a wash tub, two pots, a comfy stool, and some type of light source. So yeah, now we'll have a way to actually get purified water. Because like I said, water is kind of hard to find in this area that's not dirty. Okay, yeah, we should probably get rid of this guy. Actually, you know what, no, I'll let him be. Oh well, yeah, that's not completely not true. Oh, right. I need to actually build this, don't I? Also, got some wood. Well, some lumber that can turn into wood. I just learned how to make a bucket. I'm gonna go make myself a bucket. Don't mind me. So I can make some fresh water for that guy. Try to get him out of that bed. Uh, first things first, I need wood. Actually, I can make a stone axe now, can I? I'll make that in a second. Let me see, where is that bucket? There it is. Actually, I didn't even need wood for a bucket. Alright, let's make ourselves an axe. But yeah, I'm going to be using that axe as a hammer. That came out weird. Or not as a hammer, as a uh, weapon. I have an axe now! Go away! Actually, I shouldn't charge in this area. I don't want to do any more... That's fur. I need more of him to attack the town. How much fur do I need for the uh, Colossal Coffer again? I need two more pieces. Okay. If I find more werewolves out in the wild, I am murdering them with no hesitation. I need their fur. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh, right. Uh, bucket. I can do this. So, yeah. We can just scoop up water with the bucket. And, fortunately, now that we have a watering hole, they'll pretty much just produce water for us. Constantly. Oh, did I accidentally, I accidentally put away the water. That's fine. I'll get more. Anyways, here's your water. So do we have to wait until morning? Yeah, we have to wait until morning. What time is it? It's a bit too late to really go through the tunnel portal, but... Yeah, I'll go through the tunnel portal later. Let's just go to bed for now. I kind of want to clear up some space so I can put that other guy in bed. They kind of just been sleeping in the corner of the sick room this entire time. I really need to make some more beds for that area. Oh, hey, trees are done. That's not good. Well, I'm sure they're fine. 
here and let's go uh, take care of those trees real quick. Oh, is my bag full again? Oh, my bag is full again. Also, wait, these- oh wait, they're not fully grown yet, whoops. I forgot, it takes a few days for them to be fully grown. Alright, that's fine. No, I don't want to talk to you, Casey. I want to put my stuff away. What is that? Where did you learn how to make a fountain? I can't make a fountain yet. You know, for an area where supposedly building has been completely forgotten, they can build some pretty good stuff. Also, I still need to put down that bench. Here, you know what? I'm taking that out. I'm just going to stick in the corner over here. And I'm putting a bench down. Alright, let's go exploring. I need to grab some more saplings while I'm in that area, and hopefully I can find some iron, too. Getting an iron broadsword would be really helpful. Also, yeah, before I forget, let's stick this down. So let me see, are all my objectives... Yeah, they're all in that direction. Well, let's go see what we can find. Oh, I don't have a lot of food on me, do I? Fortunately, I think I can find, like, fruit and stuff in this area. I do find... Ooh, that's a ladder. Unfortunately, a ladder isn't going to be super helpful. Actually, no. Oh, that might be the answer I'm looking for. Ladders. Of how to get, like, my townspeople from inside the town to outside the town. Also, oh, did I get... I got paralyzed. Darn it. I wanted that cotton, but, eh. Hello, that's a werewolf. Yeah, ladders. That's the answer. With these, hopefully... I think townspeople can use ladders. I hope they can use ladders, because that's going to be their main way of getting out of the, uh, water. Oh, come here. Oh, actually, I should probably wait till paralysis wears... Oh, I know, I'm getting paralyzed. I'm standing in the paralysis flowers. Come here. Give me your fur. I think there was one down here, wasn't there, that was stuck on the ledge? Or did... Is that metal slime? That's a metal slime. Oh, I'm actually kind of hurt. Fixing that. Oh, did he run away? No, he... Oh, wow. No, he did run away. Come here. Come here, stupid metal slime. Oh, what? Oh, I had... Uh, what is it? Pumice. Hey, I got my first projectile weapon. That's not important right now. Come back here. Come back here, you stupid slime. Let me hurt you? Oh, come on. Where'd he go? Why can't I run faster? This is fine. I'll take your damage. Oh, one more hit and he's down. Was I doing something? Oh, right. I was slaying werewolves. Actually, I think I have enough fur now. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Got you. Okay, then. What was I doing? Right. Moving forward. Although, yeah, now that I have the fur, I could just warp back real quick and... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna head back real quick. I have the fur now. I can make the colossal coffer, I think. Because, yeah, I needed three pieces of that. I needed wood. And then I needed, uh... A pot. I will explore this new area at some point, but there's just so many new things I can build now. Back through the town portal. Actually, I could take those stairs, too. I'll take those stairs at some point. Not right now, though. Alright, first things first. Let's clear up the inventory a bit more. Getting these planted. Oh, I'm also starving again. I'll fix that in a second. Alright, gotta make a pot. And then I can make... Oh, I need a bit more wood. Do you have enough wood? Yep. Yes, I do. Alright, it's time. Time to not have to worry about inventory anymore. Thank God. Where do I want to put it? Uh, for now, I'll put it right here. I'll find a place to move it later. Because, yeah, I think with the Colossal Coffer... Let me just test this real quick. 
Yeah, you can actually pick it up and move it around. I didn't know this before, actually. And move it around and not have to worry about the items inside. So that's actually super helpful. But yeah, I can finally not have to worry about my inventory anymore. Also, is there food? I need food. Alright, that's good. Let's head back over. Oh wait, ladders. Right. So yeah, with ladders I can do this. What the? There we go. So now we have an easy way out. Alright, time to go see what these objectives are about. So what are we doing over here? Find the source of the paralysis. Uh, rescuing people and finding a way to make a fishing rod. So let's go take a look. Also, I'm hoping I can find some iron, but yeah, I don't remember if I can find iron in this area. I'm pretty sure I can. I'm not going to worry about a whole lot of other materials for now, though. Also, yeah, since I got rid of the ladder, we're going to have to climb up through uh, jumping. Or through vines. Alright, so let me take a quick look around. Ooh, I can grab wings. Ah, I'll grab wings later. I see a chest up there. I'll go grab that later. So let me see, are there any objectives nearby? One is right over there. And then the other two are in that area. I do like this area though. It's like a giant jungle area. Jungles are cool. Quickly pour- This is fine. I'm fine. I completely forgot about that. Man, I do a lot of falling in this game. So yeah, we need to get out of here. In case of emergency, break wall. Best instructions ever. So yeah, we need to dig our way out. I don't think it's too far away from the coast. We'll hit the coast eventually. Okay, I think that sign was lying. The exit is somewhere around here, I swear. There it is! Alright, let's go back for that guy. So yeah, um, next time I see a sign like that, I probably should, you know, jump down. Uh, where am I? The exit is over there. Yeah, let's head back for now and drop this guy off. Because I can't really do a whole lot while carrying him. And I would rather not accidentally leave him somewhere and forget where he I left him. Because that can happen, and it's kind of annoying. And judging by his sparks, I'm guessing he's paralyzed. It's just a hunch. Then the fact that he fell into a giant pile of paralysis flowers. Although, to be fair, I did that too. Actually, you know what? Wait a second. I'm just going to grab these stairs real quick. Alright, come on. Let's get you to a bed. Actually, we don't have any beds. Let's get you into a nice corner until I can get you into a bed. Also, oh, it's nighttime already. Ah, uh, I should probably go to bed. Here, I'm just going to stick you right there for now. Unfortunately, the objective won't be complete until... Oh, what? Am I under attack? Oh, I am under attack! What do you know? Whoops. That's fine, I'll put that back down at some point. Guys, could you take care of these things? I would, but I might destroy the room. Alright, let's head to bed. I'm gonna need to put down that mattress again later. Oh, and I also need to eat again. Man, eating is annoying. Oops. Yeah, don't worry, I'll find it. I'll go look in a second. Ah, uh, where's my ladder? But yeah, now that I have some stone steps, I can do this. There we go. Easy way into town. 
Man, I need to build some beds. Actually, do I have the materials to make another bed? Or, preferably, two beds? Oh, I can! Perfect. Oh, I put them in the coffer. That's fine. Uh, what do I not need with me? Don't really need- actually, I'm gonna keep the ladders for now. Don't need those, don't need those. So yeah, let's fix this. I need to expand my sick room a bit. Oh, there we go, main infirmary. All right, down you go. So you need a fried, oh, fried frog stool. Actually, I think I can make that right now. And you need a sardine on a stick. Well, unfortunately, we can't get a sardine yet. We can't fish. Fried frog stool, though. I can do that. That's pretty easy. Actually, aren't there frog stools right? Yeah, there are frog stools right there. Let's just go make him one. I really don't know how we're frying this stuff. Anyways, here's your frog stool. Uh, do you need sleep now? Yeah, you need sleep. Alright. Let's go back to exploring. Man, you can actually see the hole I left in the wall. Oh, you can actually see the flowers through there, too. I would not touch them, though. Actually, I don't think there's anything we can do with those flowers. Alright, so let's try to get at least one other objective done in this area. Getting a fishing pole would be helpful, just so I can uh, do that guy's request about wanting a sardine on a stick. Let me see, which one do I want to go to? I don't remember which one's which. And yeah, it looks like they both branch off from here, really. Oh wow, that's a lot of paralysis mushroom or paralysis flowers over there. Did I step on? I stepped on one. Darn it! Actually, I think I'm gonna head over there first because there are less flowers in that area. I mean, the best way to deal with them is just get rid of them with like a swinging weapon. Hello, that's a Reflasia. Can I get materials out of this? Oh no! Oh, sorry, that's not Reflasia. That's a Ponset. Pongsetia. Eh, I'll keep it for now. Hi there. Well, I guess you're close enough. Oh, do you want me to fix up? Yeah, you want me to fix up your walls. Alright, fine. So all we need to do is plug in his holes with, uh, dirt. Uh, does this count over here? Yeah, that counts. Alright, that should be everything. Oh no, I see a few more. Alright, so we just need to fill in these holes. Nope, not that. There we go. That should be everything. Oh no, there's one right here. There we go. So yeah, the only way in and out is through the water. I can understand that. But we learned how to make a fishing rod. From the bow user. Actually, that kind of makes sense. Uh, I don't remember what I need for that, but let's go to the next objective. Actually, one thing. I'm taking your stool. And your bed. And your floor. Alright, let's go. So let me see here. Where's the next objective? I think the next thing we need to do is find out the source of the paralysis. And, of course, it's on the other side of the giant field of flowers. Fortunately, they don't grow in water. Yeah, this area is actually pretty well uh, wooded. It's pretty much a jungle. There's also a bunch of areas to explore, like this one. Is there anything up here? Ooh, there are people up there. I would steal their ladder, but I kind of need it. 
Hi there. Oh. Wow, you guys have a really nice house, actually. Oh, he wants himself some, uh... That's actually the Paralysis Cure right there, but I don't have one right now. If I find one later, I'll bring it back for him. Also, I'm eating these. Alright, so let me see. How far away am I? Uh, still a bit of a trek. Honestly, I'm not even sure what I'm looking for. I'm just looking for the source of the Paralysis. Which is right over there. That does not look good. I have a feeling I should be prepared for a fight. Fortunately, I have my axe with me. Alright. Well, this seems normal. I'm just gonna break this real quick, if you don't mind. Oh, that is a lot of- oh, that's a lot of monsters. But yeah, fortunately I have an axe, so this isn't too bad. Doing this with like a hammer is really annoying, just because it takes so many hits to uh, break these little burrows of them. Of theirs. Also, I can just one-shot them with the charge attack. Unfortunately, the paralysis is kind of annoying, because it keeps interrupting my charging. There we go. And now the mini-boss has appeared. Oh, do I have healing items? I do. I do want to be careful, though, because he can do that. Also, his hitbox is kind of wonky. But then again, that's a lot of monsters in this game, unfortunately. I really hope they fix that in the next game. Is he broken? Nope, there he goes. There we go. Well, we killed the guy. Oh, I didn't even notice you two out, out here. Oh yeah, I kind of didn't notice you two there. Sorry about that. Well, we found the source of the paralysis, and we murdered it. Let's go home. I don't want to walk back through the paralysis floors, if you don't mind. Anyways, we're back. We know how to make a fishing rod now. We beat up the source of the paralysis. Am I still paralyzed? Nope. Here, let's just turn this quest real quick, and then we'll probably call it an episode after that. Yes, I did. It was a giant caterpillar. Well, killer pillar. Please stop doing this to me. Yeah, these animations just don't look right when they're right up against my face. But, since we told him where he came from, now he know- Yeah, why do you do that? Anyways, we got a seed of life, and we should get the uh, recipe for a paralysis cure. Sorry, no, tingle tablet. We learned how to make a tingle tablet. Oh, and a full- Actually, that's gonna be really helpful, now that I think about it. Because if we have to go back through that area, I would rather not have to deal with paralysis every single step. Anyways, let's just check what the recipe for a fishing rod is, and then I'll probably call it an episode. Can I make one right now? Oh, I can make one right now. There we go. I learned how to make a fishing rod. <laughs> you okay? Ah, that's actually pretty interesting. So yeah, we're the only ones who can actually spend any amount of time outside the village without getting sick. So, we can fish now. So yeah, now if I ever need fish, I just need to go to a body of water and cast it. Actually, I'm kind of curious about something real quick. Does this work? It does work! Oh, Now I feel sorry for him, because he literally could have just gone fit. Oh. He could have literally just gone fishing inside the town. Actually, am I gonna get anything? No, come on. I'm also really bad at fishing, by the way.
Whoops. So yeah, it kind of works like, I think, let me see if I can get this to work. Come on. So yeah, basically it works like Animal Crossing. You just wait for the big splash and then push X. I don't think I can actually catch any fish in town. Oh, I caught a sardine. Perfect. Let's make that real quick. Huh, I didn't know that actually would work, honestly. Alright, we got your sardine on a stick. Here you go, buddy. Alright, and with that I think I'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders, more building, and more curing the sick. So, till then. Also, I think we're under attack. That's fine.